As an artist, I'm responsible for making the show work out right. To me, entertainment is not a fill-in. Entertainment has to be memorable. It has to be worth the money the client puts in there. And if you can relate the entertainment to the client's idea, his product, or his slogan, or his image, perfect. That's what I try and look for in every performance. Yeah, yeah, I do my research. Basically, I look and see what everybody's doing. And I kind of like stash it here. And then I see what's on the outside. That's what I do, what nobody else is doing. Trying to do something different. Don't panic. I'm here. We'll solve this too. I always arrive a couple days before the event. Uh, planning is really important, but you have to be flexible. And timing is everything. Different things are going to occur when you're there, and you have to deal with that, and you have to adjust, you have to adapt. And I spent years perfecting that timing. So improvising is okay, a little, as long as you have a really detailed script on what you're going to do and when you're going to do it. You got to make sure that you don't have different activities at the same time that are going to be counterproductive. What you're looking for is for those activities with the perfect timing to build on each other. Boom, boom, boom. And that's what makes it memorable. And I'm there to help the client achieve that. I want the client to look good in front of the audience. I want the audience to say, wow, he brought me this show. That was amazing. I'll never forget this. I like the audience to feel that they're part of the show. That this couldn't have happened if I wasn't here. The cool thing is that the audience not only takes part in the show, but some of them actually get to take part of the show with them back home. Hey, just challenge me. I want that person in the audience to say, whoa, I'm never going to forget this. I'm always looking for ways to innovate. 